I've done the state fair and the county fair. I've showed goats and pigs, chickens, all of my life, pretty much. This year, I'm just going to be showing chickens and my vegetables and stuff. I'm homeschooled, so it's a lot easier. And I get up pretty early in the morning and go out, check on them, water them, pick them, then he picked. There was a 4-H program, the garden fair, and we, they gave us the vegetables and we took them to the fair. After that, the leftover vegetables, we would pick them and prepare them and get them ready. That's pretty much how I got started. The first thing you need to do is get all of your equipment together. Just your ruler for the head space. And I like to have at least one or two um, medium size or big bowls. And you need to call out the tomatoes. Like this one, these two will be okay for tomato juice, but not for canning the actual tomatoes. Um, this one, you just need to let it get a little bit more ripe. And this one, we've almost let it get too ripe. For the jars, you want to make sure they're not dirty or dingy, um, and they're nice and clean and new. You need to use either ball or cur jars. You don't have to, but there's an extra prize in that, so why not? I do a lot of different stuff, like yellow tomato juice. We have yellow tomatoes in our garden. The headspace on the jars needs to be at least one inch. You need to check your fair book for that. Just so like this one, this one's not full enough, so you wouldn't want to use this one. But this one's too full. 4-H is a really big part of my life. There's friendships there that are going to last a lifetime, and we go over to each other's houses. We help each other with record books. We'll call each other up. Hey, do you know any good tips for this? When you really take the vegetables out and you see what you've done at the end of the year, it's really a cool feeling knowing that you've done this. To learn more, Contact your county extension agent and follow the links in this section.